James Crawford, compliments of the season. Hope it's going to be a great year ahead. At the Vaal on Thursday, you start off with Simply Magic. Yeah, she's a very nice filly, Abon. Um, I was actually, I thought she would have run a bit better in her last start. She, she ran a bit flat for my liking, but, you know, she ran against some tough competition with the likes of Kinky Boots and Virgin River, which have proven to, um, to be quite nice horses. So I think going off of her form in her last run and how she's been performing at home, um, I think it's a matter of time before this filly breaks are made. Simply Magic's out the pack and chasing, but Fly Isabella Fly has got a length to spare. Camerata on the inside. Simply Magic Memorial Day. Camerata is starting to run home smartly. Fly Isabella Fly just got to the lead. Fly Isabella Fly on the outside. Simply Magic, but the favourite's home for favourite backers in the first. That's great news. And then uh, I think Gallic Tribe is next. Yeah, Gallic Tribe also working very well at home. Um, ran a very, very good race in the Grand Heritage. Um, I wish he wouldn't have sweated up as much, but in saying that, you know, it's horse racing, I can only do so much. But he's doing very well at home. He's come off of his race exceptionally well, uh, and I think he's going to run a competitive race. It is, it is a strong field, but I'm expecting him to have a quartet chance. Marvellous. And then uh, Global Approach is your final runner on Thursday? Yeah, Global Approach, is, it's, it's his first run out of the Maidens. Um, you know, it's a horse that he, he's always going to bring what he's capable of to the race course. So I wouldn't say he's without a chance, but, uh, you know, it is his first run out of the Maidens. So we'll see what he's capable of. There's always a, an element of mystique when you do an interview in front of a horse. And this is not just any horse. This is a horse that's come from your dad's yard, obviously has bigger fish to fry in the Gauteng summer season. Just tell us very briefly about him. Uh, yeah, Alex Maurice, he's a very, very nice horse, uh, very well-bred dynasty. Uh, stays all day, Very probably one of the best looking horses in my stable. Soft nature, big baby, but we're hoping to maybe get the classic with him if possible. I think he is a horse that's looking for 10 furlongs plus. I think it's where he's going to be at his best. So I think for a derby, he's going to be a massive, massive runner. He looks just about as close to dynasty as you could ever hope to have a horse. Like I said, Bonnie, he's probably one of the best looking horses in my stable. When, when I got him from Cape Town, I said, geez, this thing is to die for. So, I mean, I, I can't complain having him in my stable and hopefully he can achieve what we're wishing for him.